Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope you are doing good. So today we are going to see another Git tutorial and in this we will be seeing some module in Git. So we will see how to add some module, how to take a pull and push to some module. So let's get started with today's video. So firstly let me show you repo. So here you can see one git tutorial repo I'm having and another I'm having is git submodule tutorial. So this I'll be adding as submodule and main will be our git tutorial. So in submodule you can see as of now I'm having one file submodule file and inside that some text I have written. So now let's go to git submodule and here now let's clone git tutorial. Let's copy clone and I have created one blank folder git tutorial and inside that let's clone this that is our main i'm doing right now so it started cloning let's see so you can see now folder is created so inside git tutorial you can see another git tutorial so let it finish so now it's done so now we will add some module in this so command will be for that is git some module add and after that you need to pass your SSH or HTTPS how you want to clone that path and paste here so it's giving error okay I need to go to git tutorial and now run the same command so now you can see it's cloning you can open git tutorial you can see files and you can see another git some module tutorial so if you will open some module tutorial you can see the same file that i've shown you in git repo same is like fetch there so now let's create another file and now we will be doing changes from our local and pushing that to git repo so now let's add file module file and now right inside that file let's a new module file created in terminal let's go to git some module tutorial and inside that let's check git status so you can see module file is untracked files so now let's add this to our staging environment so write git add dot and after that write git commit and let's say message and module file added and now let's check git log so now you can see our commit message here so now let's clear terminal and let's push our local changes to git repo. So write command git push origin main because main branch we have. So, so let it finish. So now you can see it's finished. Now let's see and check in git. So here you can see module file. Now it's added and you can see one minute ago it's commit is done, new file created. So we have seen how to push local changes and how to add some modules. Now, now let's say if some other person making changes to same some module, then how we can fetch that. So now let's uh, add one file in Git repo only. And here let's say add new file dot php and uh, write some text here new file and commit changes. And now you can see one new commit is there that is new file.php so now let's fetch this changes to our local so now let's get to git tutorial so let's create new terminal and write cd git tutorial and inside that write command that is git some module update so git some module update you can take as a git fetch command so that will fetch the currently test like updates what all are changed and if you will pass with git submodule update and option remote so this will be like a git pull request so this will fetch the changes from like git repo to your local repo so here you can see ch changes are fetched now new file and module file you can see now it's present in your local repo so that's all in this video in this video i've shown you how you can add some module how to like push to some module and how to fetch from some module so i hope you like this video if you have any doubt related to this topic then you can comment down in the comment section thank you so much for watching please like share and subscribe to my channel thank you so much for watching